whole principle here is that by building the inner ward much higher, you command the entire outer ward from its walls. Brilliant. But once again, not a new idea. Romans had used it to great effect on their city walls at Constantinople, and it had been known to the Egyptians over 4,000 years ago. Carfili is literally a floating island fortress, surrounded by the waters of its man-made lakes. On the east side, a massive fortified dam wall. Here, you would have to pass through no less than three major gateways before you reach the inner ward and the heart of the castle. Gilbert de Clare incorporated every last element of up-to-date 1268 defensive technology in a truly frightening display of military bravado. Built by the most powerful of the Marcha lords, the purpose was to check the continuing expansion of Llewellyn ap Griffith, Prince of North Wales. His influence was becoming an increasing factor to reckon with. The concentric castle was now an active, aggressive fighting machine. Firepower had been increased dramatically because the defenders high on the inner walls could fire over the head of their fellows on the outer defences. Quite simply, a double ring of defence made far more effective use of the space available. 